All right, so I just wanted to share with you the process of recording a melody into my iPhone, into just voice memos, and then air airdropping it onto my computer. Uh, that goes into downloads, and then I basically just drag and drop that from my downloads in here into an audio track, and this is the melody. Do, 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 do. So the BPM was all messed up. It still is. Um, I figured out 106 is close-ish. And then basically lined up this first uh, few notes. Because it starts before the one. So it's like, da, 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 da. so I had to get, find out where the one was and then try to get that note da, 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 to drop on the, uh, the one. And so then I have to do that for these ones too, because I spaced it out. I didn't really sing it synced. Da, 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 da. Always the third note. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 again, so it's that one I can see that it's that there's three notes there one, two, three, da, 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 da. and then the rest will be close enough because after I so select all these, hit Command J to consolidate that, and then right click on the bar, convert to melody. So that's going to convert that audio to MIDI data for me and cut out a lot of the work for me. So now I have this super cheesy piano synth and it kind of missed a lot of the notes or I missed a lot of the notes, um, but it's, it's good enough and it's close enough for me to work with. So then double click on there to go into piano editor. Um, but first let's get a better synth. Just drop vital on there. Um, <laughs> and pluck. It's a little more. Oh, it's really off key. Um, it's really low. There's all the plucks that I like. Find a pluck you like. <laughs> Okay, I guess it's just really low. So double click that, Command A, and then Shift Up. So now I can turn this audio track off <clears throat> and actually dial in the melody. Do, do, do. Do. So this is going to be, you know, a little bit of a painstaking process. Um, it's going to take a little bit of time, but I know those are, <clears throat> so I do command a and then command U to quantize that. And I know what it sounds like in my head, so I can just go through and figure it out.
There we go. Okay, so that's our melody. That's our loop. And I'll just copy those to the end. So it loops. And there we have it. Now we can build So that's how I translate a melody into a synth line.